The National Community Action Foundation presents 2020 Hindsight, Community Action in an Uncertain World, the first NCAF virtual conference. Join us as we virtually hear from elected officials, learn about important issues happening in our country, and receive updates on the Community Action Legislative Agenda. Register for any combination of the three segments, pre-election, post-election, and general conference. And join our free network-wide virtual fly-in. We'll answer your questions about what's going on in D.C. with experts covering topics like sleeper races, what to expect from a Biden presidency, communicating with Congress in the age of COVID, and other pressing topics. From Capitol Hill, an exciting virtual conference like no other. With guest speakers, CNN's Rachel Bittekoffer, Bakari Sellers, The New York Times' Ested Herndon, and many more. Join David Bradley and hundreds of our colleagues in a virtual space dedicated to learning, sharing, and interacting with each other, exhibitors, and NCAF. Hello, Community Action. My name is Janice Warner, and I'm President and CEO of the Community Action Commission of Erie, Huron, and Richland Counties, located in Sandusky, Ohio. Back in March, I was all excited in preparing for the NCAP conference in Washington, D.C., but we all know what happened then, the COVID-19 pandemic. So we had to change and alter the way we did operations. So I was excited at that time. I wanted to hear about the speakers that David was going to have for us. But more importantly, I was excited about the Hill visits and also networking with the Community Action family. Virtual conference is the new norm, and because we attend from the comforts of our home and office. So I would like to encourage all leaders of community action agencies to give board members and staff who never attend the NCAP conference an opportunity so they can experience the community action movement. Thank you. Hello, everyone. My name is Quadea. I'm with the Commission on Economic Opportunity in Northeastern Pennsylvania. I'm really excited to attend this year's NCAF virtual conference, especially since I wasn't able to attend back in March. I'm really excited about the post-election segment and learning what the election results may mean for the Community Action Network in the coming years. 2020 has been a shocking year for us all. I feel there's never been a better time to discuss and understand the issues and learn more about what we can do at our community action agencies to help navigate through these challenging times. I encourage everyone involved in community action to attend this year's NCAF virtual conference. It'll be just as informative as the past year's conferences. The only difference is we'll all remain safe by staying socially distant. Aloha from Hawaii. My name is Robert Piper and I'm the Executive Director and CEO of the Honolulu Community Action Program. I also serve on the Board of Directors for the National Community Action Foundation, proudly serving Region 9 and representing the great states of Arizona, California, Hawaii, Nevada and the Outer Pacific Islands. My staff and I and our Board of Directors look forward to participating in this year's virtual 2020 NCAF conference. With today's pricing structure, we'll be able to participate in much greater numbers than ever before. We look forward to participating in the conference and staying on top of the presidential and U.S. Senate races, both on a pre- and post-election basis. We also look forward to being able to better navigate today's challenges that we all face as a country and to reinvigorate ourselves with regards to our mission of fighting poverty across the nation as a community action network. As someone who's had to fly for over 13 hours to participate in this conference in normal years, I'm looking forward to participating this year on a virtual basis. I look forward to seeing all of you there. And in the meantime, please stay safe and please stay well. Mahalo. Registration for the 2020 NCAP Virtual Conference is now open.